I've never seen a samurai fight like that. It was nothing. You are more than a samurai. He is a vengeful spirit, back from the grave to slaughter the Mongols. Where do we hide now? You don't. Fire up a forge, and get back to making strong Komatsu weapons. That's how we fight back. That's how we'll save Lord Shimura. Vengeful spirit? I think they liked it. I read that samurai follow a path of honor. It is one of the many differences between us. Hmm. Then why have my men found their brothers stabbed in the back? Lord Sakai would never resort to such tactics. War brings out who we truly are. It has made you a dog, unleashed by your cousin Kublai to rape and pillage at his command. Your nephew strays from the warrior's path. You will become what you hate. Unless you join my empire's fight for peace. You don't want allies. You want soldiers to overthrow the Shogun. Consider my offer. Help your nephew regain his honor before his cowardice goes too far. And before I bring you his head. I can't free my uncle until Taka finishes what he's working on. Still working on your climbing tool, my lord. It will be of use. Give me more time. You will like the finish. Apologies. You don't have what we need to do the work. 
You have my thanks. I'll never forget them. Your sword arm protects us all, my lord. Trade is difficult in these times, my lord. Lord Sakai, you survived the invasion? So far. Have we met before? Uh, no, my lord. But I watched you ride into battle. Please accept this gift. If you wear it, they say a spirit will lead you to whatever you're looking for. Sounds like something you could use yourself. Not with Mongols prowling the countryside. But if it leads you to any flowers, bring them to me. Or other traders. We can use them to fashion dyes. I'll remember that. Thank you. If you can bring more, it's yours. Go with Kami's protection.
But I'm asking if you believe it. Someone slaughtered the Mongols at Komatsu Forge. The spirit of a dead samurai? I can help improve your blades, my lord. Apologies. You don't have what we need to do the work. Farewell. Your blade will keep us safe. My brother wanted to be a samurai, Lord Sakai. He built a bamboo training stand, spent a whole winter practicing on it. Bamboo cutting. An excellent way to become a better swordsman. Perhaps I can join your brother in practice. Sadly, he died of fever a few years ago. But every time I see a stand beneath its flag, I think of him. And now, so will I. Thank you. Take care. Susano, protect me. Dead bodies. Who killed these people? A fearsome warrior. He demanded I tell him the tale of Shigenori's heavenly strike. When he didn't hear the answers he sought, he flew into a rage and butchered them. What did he want to know? I am not sure, my lord. Tell me the story. I need to know what he's after. When Tsushima was first settled, a strange and terrible thunderstorm swept across our island. Wherever lightning struck, beasts of lightning appeared. These violent creatures tore through villages, causing death and destruction, moving too quickly to be stopped. The people knew only one man who could possibly stand against the lightning beasts, Shigenori. The fastest swordsman in all of Tsushima, Shigenori, never lost a duel. With years of practice, he had created the Heavenly Strike, an attack that struck quicker than the eye could follow. Shigenori lured the creatures to a desolate beach in Komatsu, 
where the sand would slow their movement. Their clash turned the sand to ash and bleached the leaves of trees white. Shigenori's heavenly strike cut through them faster than they could move. As the final beast fell, the storm cleared and Tsushima was safe again. Shigenori began a life of seclusion. Few students found him, and only the bravest and most skilled proved worthy of learning the heavenly strike. When a storm approaches, a sword is placed at Shigenori's rest by a student who knows of its location to ward off attacks from beasts of nature. The murderer wishes to learn Shigenori's heavenly strike. It sounds dangerous in the wrong hands. Which way did he go? A woman fled toward a nearby bridge. He chased her. He'll answer for what he did here. That's the bridge the musician mentioned. Someone weeping. Where? My lord, so many. He's slaughtered. Did you see the man who killed them? I know who he is. Yasuhira Koga. I've heard the name. He fought for the Yarikoa clan. Would you recognize him? I'll never forget that leering face. Follow me. Perhaps I can pick up his trail on the other side of the bridge. Horse tracks. Yasuhiro was in a hurry. What more do you know of Yasuhiro Koga? Only that he was a retainer for the Yarikawa clan years ago. After the rebellion was crushed, the clan was dissolved and retainers dismissed. Rumor says he left Tsushima, but when the Mongols attacked, he returned. From where, I'm not sure. It doesn't matter. He cannot be allowed to live after what he's done. Up ahead, they're constructing a roadblock. Mongols, hide yourself. Get 
I don't see Yasuhira Koga anywhere. We're pursuing a man named Yasuhira Koga. He just left. He's been staying in the watchtower. Working with the Mongols? Yes. But last night they argued. Only made out one word. Chigenori. I'll search the watchtower. Find somewhere safe before more Mongols come. What has Yasuhira been doing? White leaves, like those bleached by lightning in the tail. The Mongols have their own version of Shigenori's tail. Maybe he wanted to compare it to the musician's version. A dueling ring. He's looking for it. Yasuhira is looking for someone who can teach him Shigenori's heavenly strike. The white leaves. There are trees like that not far from here. That's where he went. You've helped enough. Get to safety with the others. Thank you, my lord. I hope you punish that monster. Need to find white leafed trees. Careful, my lord. This path is dangerous. Huh. 
White leaves. Has to be the place. Those bleached by lightning in the tail. You 
going to be all right. Thank you for saving me. Someone's Everyone been tortured. Everyone says Forge would have burned without you. Was a man named Yasuhira with these Mongols. Mm. He wanted to learn the heavenly strike from my grandfather and took him away. Your grandfather's in danger. Where did they go? His old training ground. A dueling ring on the Komatsu coast. Please, save him. So here I cannot learn the heavenly strike. down in order to cross. Yasuhira brought Mongols with him. Fight me! Okay. 
That must be Shigenori's dueling ring. What has Yasuhira been doing? Poor man. Killed by Yasuhira. Blade has seen many duels. Footprints. Still fresh. Yasuhira Koga, the butcher of the rebellion. Time hasn't changed you. You were a child when Yorikawa burned, boy. For 15 years, I dreamed of cutting Lord Shimura to the bone. You won't live long enough to face him. The old man taught me the legendary attack before I killed him. Let me show you. for boy not waiting study learning save you. You deserve greater respect than this. I promise I'll use Shigenori's technique to protect Tsushima against all who would harm it. Gods will investigate odd sounds. These chimes can be a distraction or a lure.
your skills.
So peaceful here. What is this place? I thought you were Lord Jin Loku, but you're another samurai. Welcome, my lord. Another samurai? You haven't heard of Lord Jin Loku? He's a legendary samurai. I'd like to meet him. When will he return? Soon. Join us for dinner. Perhaps he'll share one of his grand stories with you. Don't worry, I'm unharmed. Oh, I wasn't expecting a visitor. We're happy to have you, of course. Hmm. Thank you. I didn't realize any other samurai had survived. It was a fierce battle, wasn't it? The beaches of Komatsu ran red with blood that terrible day. We fought at Komoda. <laughs> of course. Forgive me. I'm tired from a long ride. Please, have Nabe show you the bath. We can speak more over dinner. Please follow me, my lord. How much do you know of Lord Jinroku? He tells us everything. If it wasn't for him, we would have lost the whole island. When you met him, was he armed? He gave everything to save Tsushima except his horse. It's at the stables. My bath can wait. I want to look at his horse. I know this saddle. It belonged to Lord Higuchi. Jinroku is no samurai. I'll get the truth from him. Where is Jinroku? He left quickly after you went to the bath. It must have been important. I'll find him.
We need to talk. Stop running, you fool! Stop! Before it's too late! I don't want to kill you. Stop! I challenge you to a duel! You want to fight me? Yes. It's the only way. If that's your wish, I accept. I don't want to die. I surrender. I'm sorry. Tell me who you really are. I'm nobody. I was just trying to survive. You're impersonating a samurai and bringing dishonor to the name. And you're taking advantage of those women. I know. Please, my lord, let me live. I'll never go back there again. Leave. And if I ever see you wearing that armor again, we will finish our duel. You tell those women the truth.
Lord Sakai, welcome back. Jinroku wasn't the man you thought. He wasn't a samurai at all. Ah, he told you the truth. You knew he was lying? He seemed harmless, and we enjoy having him around. I hope you didn't kill him. He's alive, but he won't be coming back. I'll t tell the others he left on an important mission. We were fine without him. We will be again. Oh. 